Hello everybody, good morning and welcome to Powered by the Moon 7. Happy Monday. Guys, it is Christmas time. I am ready to bring it in. So I felt every Monday I'm going to arrive in my Christmas PJs. Um, I'm going to be having my coffee. Uh, and this guy, he's going to have to get some antlers on or something. Guys, we're here to do your Monday morning every Monday morning. Not to felt, I will be here to do your Monday feels, Monday through Friday. So it was a bit hard. Went to walk my dogs. A pit bull came out. I mean, barely grazed my arm, but really got my dogs here. I, and I didn't know if I was going to make it in here today because my whole body was riddled with anger. Because why do people get dogs that they can't control? It's not the dog's fault. It's the owner's. I have not felt that anger, guys, in two something years, and ah, she's doing much better. Her jaw is out to here, but she's gonna be all right. Um, and I was able to just really hone in and come in here and be excited and put my energy into this and find out what is gonna be happening this week and next week and next week till Christmas, guys. The new year, put what you need to be pushing through until to get into the new years. What you need to release is up for water, fire, and earth. Um, air, you will be up in the next day or two, guaranteed. But let's get right into this. We're going to take what resonates. We're going to take what does. And if it's not your story, you'll catch me on the next one. Or go look at your signs. Please like and subscribe. If it's horrible, own it, guys. I say it every time. Don't put it on the other person. Own it. Give it light. Move it along. Let's do this for our collective for Monday morning feels. Weekly feels, right? Monday morning weekly feels. <laughs> Here we go, led by God. Guide by the Spirit, let's go. I've been recording outside, but it's nice to be back in here. Everything was fully charged under the new moon with the solar eclipse. Everything feels fantastic. Guys, what are you doing for your holidays? If you do not celebrate Christmas, happy Hanukkah. Happy, you know, whatever you celebrate, you know, I hope it's a good one. Let's all feel blessed this year. Things are going a little bit better and smoother. Let's do this shirt. Okay. Let's go for it. Oh, somebody's missing you on Monday. Or are you them? Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's too much new love. I just saw that I'm not taking all this though, guys. You stressed about missing somebody? You need to make the effort, maybe. Let's go. Come on, spirit. On the table. One at a time. One for Tuesday. On the table, spirit. Romance. You're missing somebody's romance. Your feelings are real and worth exploring, guys. So, isolation for Wednesday. Possible message coming your way. All right. Oh, geez. Your ex-partner single, guys. <laughs> Monday missing you. Your absence is felt. They long for your embrace. So this is your vice versa, but maybe it's yours. Feeling that way. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. Isolation alone time is needed. Time to deep soul search and I can imagine if you're going to think about or about this unfinished love connection the situation involves an ex so you may need to soul search here and then they are single and available to uh, pursue so there you go the ex of yours is single now this is an ex-boss, ex-friend. Can't be an ex-mother, how you actually mother, but just 
X, whatever. I caught a bone because I got my lights on and I'm thinking here you can see them, but that's fine. It's about the spirit. Okay guys, so I do have some Christmas decks, but I'm gonna connect with them a little bit more and by next Monday I will be reading them. I got the Major Arcanas. I got a regular playing Christmas deck, which I've learned to read really with playing cards, and I'm actually getting quite good at it. The same, and I got the Night Before Christmas deck. So those will be coming into play next week. Right now, let's just go to this one, the Gilded Tarot. It's just become one of my new favorite decks now. I have it in the mini. I still do. Right now I'm, I don't know, I'm getting away from the mini minis, but I still like my smaller decks. The mini mini ones, I like them, I appreciate them as I was, you know, growing into reading and how I was going to shuffle and how I was guided to get my cards out. It was just easier to uh, navigate at first. What's your favorite Christmas song, guys? Who are they missing? What is going on here on Monday? What are they missing? Who? Hmm. Seven of Swords, guys. Are you really missing that? You missing lies and deception? Maybe keeping things... That's usually the four of... Confusion. Are you confused about something somebody's just said or done? Nine of Cups. Let's go. to at least did you miss some I don't know if this um, seven of swords though is like maybe they're not saying exactly everything that they feel like that's usually sneakiness and deception and lies and, and usually four coins is that way but I see that there's a lot of confusion around this and there's this needs to be a decision or judgment call made There will be a reunion that you don't see coming. You guys would have to spend a lot and have a lot of strength to get through whatever it is. That's okay though. If you love each other enough, you will. Your feelings are really worth exploring on Tuesday. So let's see, is this the same person? Okay. So basically, you're not communicating this with this person. Ace of Swords in Reverse and um, High Priestess, you're not communicating your feelings, your thoughts. So maybe you're the one being a little deceptive with some options and maybe you, you're making a judgment call on your options and you're just not speaking about it right now. Maybe you have somebody else in your life, but you're thinking about a next partner here, and that's where you're becoming the Seven of Swords over there. It's the same. Let's see, one more out, one more out for Tuesday. Tuesday, one more out. Confident, single, independent. Maybe you want to be, you're manifesting something here. Okay, I said, okay, one more out. Oh, there's some drama, but you're going to make this decision. Probably while you're in isolation, there will be a decision made on your feelings. And towards whom? Not see a third party here, but guys, I just... I feel like you got something going on. Either you're not being fully honest or someone's not being fully honest with you. I can tell you that with the Seven of Swords. Is Ace of Swords in reverse and the High Priestess in reverse? Come on, juggling's going on. Decisions need to be made 
I'm seeing two, two points, two ones, two, two, two. Six of Cups. Isolation. A long time is needed. Time for deep soul searching about what? Your past? The sex partner. This is about somebody in your past, guys. That is single. But are you is the question. Oh, what is this six cup? Conflict up in your head. Five of swords is swords underneath that. Yes, you got some conflict in your head. Some battles going on. But you're about to ride in. Uh, you know, you're feeling the love. Here comes the Knight of Cups. Maybe you're going to... quickly with the ace of swords to talk to somebody or they are you your past is coming six of cups knight of cups past is coming in or you're going to them to talk to them for what apology you owe them an apology did they owe you one he did come out up like this so i mean realistically he's like this so i mean maybe you weren't given one or you you feel you needed to give one and you didn't ex-partner feeling less backstabbed feeling less betrayed you're coming out of that or they are so i mean if somebody's coming out of betrayal and backstabbing right they're going to need to isolate and uh, go within about their romantic feelings. Coming out of hand, man. I keep seeing these five of wands, guys. Wish fulfillment. Could be other people involved. People stopping this connection, interfering. Could be some outside interference. Who knows? It's always annoying. Not the card on the floor. Outside interference. But this is kind of too, right? Like, now I gotta go find it. Sorry, everybody. There it is. Oh my gosh, I'm really gonna do them. Am I crazy, guys? That's not underneath there, so. Wow. Oh, guys, what do I do? Well, they still want to in reverse. Chariots reverse, you're stuck. Somebody's coming out of a trail from a brand new beginning or wanting it and they're not seeing it ahead of them yet. Sun's in reverse, guys. Ooh, but the devil's upright. Come on. Ah, there's the chair in reverse still. So you're gonna, you're gonna find justice eventually at the bottom of the deck of what you don't see coming. Somebody's gonna come riding in Take that cup of love, there'll be an offer, if you're to offer it, or vice versa. I know it's scary, so a lot of us just don't, right? Um, let's see, so you're stuck with this hat and not having yet a passionate new beginning, just trying to get out of a trellis, betrayal state or phase, or they are with the ex-partner, okay? My hair got all crazy on that thing. This is one of my favorite Christmas songs. 
this one and silent night. Reminds me of my grandmother's. I sit at the piano, the organ, and play. It was beautiful. You know, one of my great grand, my great grandmother is my guide. If you were to watch my first video, okay, single with that Queen of Cups like that. Is that your ex? Because you got a lot of love to give us, so unconditional. Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Or is that you to them? With the victory, guys. This looks beautiful. Don't be scared. See, if you don't know, you don't know. And a lot of times, we're not going for it if we don't know, right? Like, we're not going to just run in there and be like, oh, you know. Who knows what they got going on in their life? Unless you keep in touch. But I see... If you moved in, oh, there'll be healing done. And yeah, this is on, um, this will move into uh, better luck, but you're going to have to do healing first because you're Wheel of Fortune. You're next to the victory, but until you heal, you will not move forward with this, okay? Yeah. Feeling is healing, so you're going to need the patience. You'll come out of hang mode, man mode. You'll put the drama aside from you. You'll feel confident and, and ready to go forward and speak to this person that you're watching, you're spying on them, you. Maybe they walked away from you or you walked away from them. There was the King of Cup. So guys, what I got here is that, you know, you, got, you may be holding back your feelings and some confusion. You're not speaking about it at all. At all. Maybe at a distance. I don't know. Um, but you want to go as a knight of kings and uh, either offer this apology that wasn't in the past or that you feel it may it should be to this person in your past. Your, um, that's a reconciliation card. And you can ex partner. So now I know I'm on the right track. And then you got your ten of swords and your ace of wands. So he's trying to come out of the ace. They're, t they're being backstabbed and betrayed. X or you. To have a passion, new beginning, because they're stuck. Or you're stuck. Okay? This person or you have a lot of unconditional love to give, and you feel that you could be victorious about this, but there's going to be need and healing, you know? And I, I don't want to say on your part or just their part. I feel on the both of your parts in this relationship in general. And like I said back here, I could see a lot of work would need to be done for healing to be brought to this relation. But like I said, if you love each other enough, you will. Okay, let's go. Yes, so tell me your favorite Christmas songs, what you guys want for Christmas. Thank you for coming in here on Monday mornings. I hope you'll return next Monday. See what, you know, if this didn't resonate, hopefully next Monday it does with you. Um, every week they do seem to change. The signs are up and some of them are pretty wild. Pretty wild. So you could be dealing with cancer, a lot of water, there's Scorpio, Scorpio, uh, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. You got uh, some air here with the swords. Let's see, you got Virgo. Aries. Okay, air, like I said, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Not too much uh, fire in here, guys. It's a lot of water and uh, more uh, water and air signs. Okay, led by God, guided by you, Spirit. Let's go. Another collector. Let's go. One more out. I'm going to go chill with my baby and hold her. My poor baby. She was protecting her mama. Okay. And then my other one, the little one's like trying to bite at this pit bull's mouth as it's like locked on. <laughs> okay, what's he going to do? <laughs> oh. 
Yeah, you're feeling the orphan, or they are, or you both are. I feel this is a mirroring thing going on. You both need to go the distance, I feel. So you don't feel, or, and chop wood, get to it. Like, you guys know this is here. I feel you're both ignoring it. Some people in this need to be flexible. You see, yes, I knew you guys are knowing it. Right underneath the deck, deep knowing. You know, you both know. Think, yes, damn, I can't get any better. Tick tock. Between worlds and then clean it up. All right, guys. All right, guys, that's it for your Monday weekly fills this week. And next week, I'll be coming back out. I will get your air signs up, guys. I'm loving being outside, but now that it's uh, not the weekend, I'll be inside to do those. Um, if you want a read, I'm pretty booked during the week um, right now. I do have a few slots on the weekend. I do work a day job, so when I get home, energetically, I can only read two people, maybe three. Um, I don't like to push it because I like to get the best readings. Also, guys, I do not time my readings. It's, right now, it's $45 why Christmas is going on. When the cards are done, I'm done. We don't get to 30 minutes in the cliffhanger and your money's out, okay? I'm not that reader. I never will be. I never want to be, and I'm not going to be. We're not going to leave people at cliffhangers over a little bit of money. All right. You guys be great. If it resonates, please like and subscribe. Please come back next week and every week. I'd love the support. Hop on over to Powered by the Moon 7 Instagram where I do do a lot of posting of cells. Um, other, uh, they get the weekend fills over there. So, yeah. You know, I'm starting to dig this. I'm starting to get better, more comfortable. I'm not feeling as nervous. Yeah, I am a little bit, but yet... I'm coming out of that and I want to thank any of you that have liked my um, videos or like three of you have shot me emails and I appreciate those even though you know it's not a lot to somebody but it's enough for me. Um, please be safe out there, be happy, be joyous, we're in the best season ever and be blessed. I'll see you guys next week. Bye for now.